Today, I have Mark Fuquay. Did I get that? Pretty close. Okay, what is it? Fuquay. Few. Ah, oh, jeez. It's all right. People That's say it right. like that all the time. And Mark owns MND Enterprises, and it's sort of like the Swiss Army knife of outdoor stuff. We, we like to say, and we just coined this phrase this year for your best backyard, porch, or patio, we're your people. Uh, you know. You've seen the ads. I'll put, Ivan will put the ad up here because, I mean, they're everywhere. Right. And he's been uh, working with us for almost a year now, I guess. Yep. Maybe yep. over right a year. Right out of here, a little over. Um, and you've got, how many stores are there? We, we have five stores that are manned locations. Where are they at? We, um, we start in down south in Weatherford, Oklahoma, all of them in Oklahoma. Mm -hmm. So Weatherford, Canton, Sealing, and two in Woodward. Wow. Yeah. Okay. And they're, uh, so let's run your product line. Wow. Well, yeah, the big big items. Everything for your back <laughs> for your backyard and then some. Um, we do portable buildings, storm mm -hmm. shelters, uh, carports, garages, lawn mowers. We're probably the largest volume mower dealer in Western Oklahoma. Mm -hmm. uh, we sell six or seven different lines. It varies. Some come, some Depends go. Depends on what you need. Yeah, yeah exactly. Okay. And we've got we've got the big names: Grasshopper, Hustler, Toro. Uh, oh, you're a grasshopper dealer. We are a grasshopper. That's hard dealer. to get. Yeah, it is. Wow. And, and, okay. and we have we have been enjoying that for a couple of years now. Mm -hmm. uh, People that like good equipment, like you know, like yep. grasshopper, if they're if they're into commercial type. The, I didn't realize that you know we bought a new mower a few years ago, but the that grasshopper brand is that's like you know Ford Chevrolet stuff. It's I mean, legendary. When you buy it, it's yeah. You don't you don't change. It, so. it, we joke that it's almost cultish because <laughs> if once they've had a grasshopper, they they, they don't, don't back want up. anything else they hardly. Don't go yeah. backwards. And then you were telling me earlier that. Um, it's this is coming. We're over the over the January thing. Storm season is coming, and you have some storm shelters. We on we sale, do or? we do have sales on our storm shelters right now. What what happens every year? People want to wait until it's storm season to order their storm shelter. Wait until they're standing out yeah. looking at the storm. You know, the hey, tornado's coming over the hill. Hey, M and D, do you have a storm shelter? <laughs> yeah, and it's going to be about three months before we can put that in. Where if they order now, yep, uh, we we can usually put it in within thirty days or so. So we try to run this special to get people to go ahead and place that order. Order, so they'll have it by storm season, mm -hmm. not wait until storm season where it's so yep. busy that we had a three you just month. You can't get yeah. it. You'll get right. it for the next year's right. storm season. Well, yeah. and it is, we, we joke about it a little internally. Some of the same people have hit us up three or four years in a row and they always wait. And then they're like, well, I'll just, I, I, next I, it year. won't even be here until after storm season. Yeah. I'll just wait until next it. year. Right. Sure. <laughs> Dig a hole. Um, <sighs> and then the, the portable buildings, I know you, you've... Um, we sell I for Dirksen. I see those all over the place. Yeah, it's yes. one of the largest, oldest names. In I think it is the oldest portable building name in the business. Mm -hmm. uh, Mennonite brand, yep. and and uh, really well built structures. And right now they have like a ten percent off on most of those those buildings. So you know, there's there's definitely some deals out there right now. They I tried to build one a, f a few years ago. You know, just going and buying the lumber and it, buying one like that. So much better product, yeah, I was gonna and say, and you have it that fast, and right? I was gonna say if you can build one, the quality that these guys build one for mm -hmm. the money they can build it for, I'll, yeah. I'd be impressed because yeah. it's pretty hard to the do. The volume, yeah. volume building and being able to build inside of a building right. where it's air, you know you and, have and, uh, and do it in a day, not not yeah. where it would take me six months to try mm -hmm. to build that building, and they they can put out four or five of them a day yep. and still keep the quality there. When you're buying your lumber by the train load mm -hmm. like they do, you know it makes a big difference using jigs to make sure, sure they're square sure. and you can move much faster right that's, that's pretty pretty cool yeah and uh, were well, you telling me earlier that this thing didn't start off this way it was it started as a small what was your first product i well i was just going to put some i i used to have a car lot in canton okay and and the building that we are in in canton i owned that building mm -hmm. and i was just going to put a couple of portable buildings and some storm shelters and a couple of carports out there and and you know just piddle with right. outdoor outdoor backyard stuff mm -hmm. just in canton and as things do sometimes, they just kind of went from there, and now we're five stores and, and a top 10 mower dealer in the nation. And, you know, we, we wow. have been blessed, and we're very thankful for our customers who make that possible. I mean, mm -hmm. we certainly, doesn't matter what we do, if we don't have them, we can't do anything. Well, it's, Mark, it says, says a lot about your, your service and, and the product you sell, that if people 
you know, like what you do, you're got to grow. Right. I mean, you can't hold it back. Right. And obviously, that's kind of what happened to you. Well, it, 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 it seems off. to be something. Something good happened, and we're we're thankful. We, right. we, and we worked hard to get it, but you know, it we we still can't do it without the customer. So, are you going to get a store on this side of the state, like yeah. in Hennessy? You know, it is funny. Mm -hmm. We we've been approached by Fairview people in Hennessy, mm -hmm. and and two years ago when COVID hit, we were getting sought after fairly hard to come this direction mm -hmm. and i just couldn't do it we didn't have the inventory to even fill well, the stores true. we had yeah, when you because, had yeah with covid stuff you couldn't even get so things. you go get the expense of opening another store but you don't have the product to supply it you're going to mm -hmm. look a little silly so yeah. i just kind of dug my feet in and held my ground for a while but mm -hmm. we we're always looking for new opportunities and uh it is exciting to think about expansion to the east because the, the, the further east you go the more populous you get yep. and and the bigger the population mm -hmm. the greater the opportunity and if i feel like if we can survive in western oklahoma we could probably make it just about anywhere because yep. it's tough times and tough people out here a lot mm -hmm. so and and if you can make it through that you're probably going to go on and do okay wherever so and i'm sure the reason you're able to you know keep your prices in line is because of volume we, we, we try so, to do volume you know a, a, a local owned company even though you have multiple locations right. that's really really important right well and if we didn't have the multiple locations we couldn't do the volume which right. helps us keep our prices where mm -hmm. you know in line and and I, i'd like to think you can't buy a mower anywhere any cheaper i mean mm -hmm. we we try to do whatever we can we never ask msrp we always sell at promo mm -hmm. uh you know lower pricing and and we sell probably five 500 mowers a year and you you repair your own stuff we do we we, we as a matter of fact uh, we have a heck of a service business on the mower side and we just began what we call our winter service special where we encourage people to go ahead and what will discount the pricing to go ahead and get them in this winter keep our mechanics busy mm -hmm. Get them ready for spring before spring, much like the uh, the. Well, storm what I shelter. do is I, I I'm going to do that next year. Yeah. And then before long, the yeah. blades are like this long because right. they're all worn down. Right. And, geez. Yeah. So okay. so we like to let our professionals get a hold of them, mm -hmm. service the engine, check the blades, the pulleys, the belts, and have you ready to roll for next spring when the grass starts growing. Very cool. Now you also sell um, like carports and metal buildings. We sell large metal structures or small ones from from small carports to enclosed garages to large ag structures, lean-tos, uh, horse sheds. We've got some great specials on those right now, mm -hmm. uh, up to 30% off on $10,000 uh, dollar or more structures and, and these are buildings that. like the one we're in here very like, much so a, a very, shop, you know you get a 20 building. by 40 shop or a 10 by you know 12 by 20 or well, you whatever. know when i see those you know you see them on the side of the road the carports we think that's that's what we're talking but you're talking about real metal buildings we, we sell well we it is carport frame right or up to 30, 30 wide and then over 30 wide we get into a truss style frame okay uh but yeah for an economical structure to protect your uh stuff yep. can't, rv can't beat them. Tools, yeah RV, we sell a bunch of rv ports mm -hmm. tall you know rv ports for people to store their their rvs in very cool Mark, thank you so much for hanging out today. Hey, thank you. You it's bet. Great to meet you. Be sure to click the subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell to be sure you never miss an episode of the All About Hennessy Show. Check out this week's All About Hennessy Post newspaper and subscribe for free at allabouthennessy.com.